Hey guys, so I'm just getting out of the shower, so ignore my hair. It's a bit much, but I wanted to show you guys my skincare routine. A lot of you guys have been asking me about that. My um, nightly skincare routine, so I'm about to do it. All I use are natural ingredients on my face, and I wanted to show you guys exactly what I did. This is for my girls who are in their 30s or above even, for anti-aging, for fine lines and wrinkles, producing more collagen, getting that plumpness back to your face. So stay tuned, I'm gonna show you everything that I do in order to keep my skin glowy and youthful. So I really just spent all that time looking for a bow. Not that you guys know how much time that was, but I have bows everywhere. And of course, when I'm about to do a video, I can't find a bow. But anyway, so I'm just gonna put my hair up in a bun. Ooh, that's a little too tight. Oh, there, that's better. But okay, so the first thing that I use is aloe. And I use aloe from the plant. So make sure to pick aloe up from the plant. So you can use the leaf. And um, because if you use like a watered version of it or something that you pick up from the store, it's not gonna have any of the nutrients there. So what I do is I just take a, I just kind of gut it a bit. And I take this and I rub it all over my face. And the reason this works well in your skincare routine is because Aloe has something in it called sterols. It's a molecule called sterols. And what that does is it helps to increase the production of collagen as well as elastin. And then it also helps to retain moisture. So this is gonna be really great in any areas that you may have fine lines or wrinkles. And it's also great for the prevention of that. So what I do, like I said, is I just take this and I put this all over my face and I leave this on as like a bit of a mask for about 10 minutes and then I move on to my next step. And when you're getting close to your eyes like this, just make sure not to get it in your eyes, but you definitely wanna get those areas that may like get crow's feet or something like that. And any areas where, any problem areas that you feel like you're having, my problem areas I feel like are right here. I feel like that's probably everyone's problem areas, like the frown line area. And then also get over your lid. And again, you wanna keep this on for about 10 minutes. I dropped that piece on the floor. I had to slice a whole nother piece open. Okay, so I let the aloe sit for 10 minutes. I just finished rinsing it off. And I just used a wet rag to kind of like pat it moist or dry. And so now what I'm gonna do is make a mask with Manuka honey. And Manuka honey is really great for the skin because it also helps to promote collagen. You wanna make sure it has a UMF, which stands for Unique Manuka Factor of at least 16 plus. And then I'm going to use Siggy's yogurt, which is also good for the skin as far as anti-aging properties because it helps to tighten the skin. The lactic acid actually works as a chemical exfoliant to the skin. It makes the skin brighter and it also plumps the skin. And I like Siggy's because it has live probiotics in it. So that's also gonna help to fight against discoloration, infection, any type of bacteria that you may have on your face. So basically it's going to help prevent against acne as well. And so does the Manuka honey. The Manuka honey is also really good for eczema or any type of discoloration and brightening the skin as well so it's a double whammy what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put these two together and make a mask out of this all right I legit call this my youth serum I can't wait for you guys to see how glowy my skin looks after this so what I have here is a dish and a spoon and I'm gonna uh, first apply it with the spoon but then I'm gonna end up using my fingers to make sure that I get it really rubbed and massaged well into my skin and this makes your skin so glowy, so radiant. I leave this on for at least 20 minutes, but sometimes I can leave it on. Hey, Sebastian. My kitty cat just walked in. But um, sometimes I will leave it on for four hours or eight hours. I'll leave it on as long as I can because this works so well. And make sure you're getting Manuka honey because that is different from your typical raw honey or honey that you get from just like the grocer. You wanna make sure you're getting Manuka honey. And it smells so good.
You guys see how all of the color is just rushing to my face? I love this mask. Okay, so it's been just a little bit over an hour and this is what my skin looks like after I just rinsed everything off and then I took a wet washcloth and kind of moist dried it. And um, so this is where we are and I feel like it looks glowy and radiant and this is why I love that mask. So now the last thing that I do is I moisturize and I moisturize with coconut oil. Looks like that. I get mine from 365 from Whole Foods, but whatever you do, just make sure you're getting organic and make sure you're getting unrefined. And this is my final step. And I take about that much and I just rub this all over my face. And it's thick and creamy, but this is what I use for moisturizer at night. And I just make sure not to press too hard, but to massage well into my skin. Make sure to get those lips too. You wake up and your lips are so soft and your skin is just so soft. Make sure you get your neck. With everything that we apply today, make sure you get your neck as well because that area does start to show signs of aging also. So make sure you get that well. And this is my simple nighttime skin routine. And everything that we use was natural and organic. If you guys have any questions for me, just make sure to leave it in the comment box below. Also for girls who have dark spots under the eyes because you guys did ask me about that, all you have to do is put coffee grounds under your lids with like the back of a spoon with like, I feel like I should do a tutorial on this too, but with like an oil base and then put the coffee grounds directly under the lids and leave it there for 15 minutes and do that on a daily to get rid of the black circles under your eyes. But other than that, please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is at A underscore beauty underscore beast. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.